Assalamu alaikum guys welcome back to Seven Engineers YouTube channel. Today in this video series I will discuss 200 technical terms for Seven Engineers and every Seven Engineer should remember these 200 technical terms which I am discussing in this video. Guys this is the part first and maybe I will make about 20 videos of this series so let's start guys but these uh, 200 technical terms are uh, very important for uh, those civil engineering students which are working on construction site or if they are non civil engineer okay so let's start here guys the first one is weight of cement bag weight of one cement bag is 50 kgs okay the second one is also uh, about cement that is density of cement what is the density of cement that is guys 1440 kgs per meter cube with the help of density of cement, you can find numbers of bags very easily. Uh, if you find first of all density of cement, then you are able uh, to find uh, how many uh, numbers of cement bag required in one meter cube, right? As you can see guys, the third one is numbers of cement bags in one meter cube, okay? So we required our, uh, we have in one meter cube 28.8 numbers of bags, right? Cement. The fourth one is guys that is DPC dam proof course which thickness should not be less than 2.5 centimeter okay you can see guys this is a foundation okay so the thickness of DPC dam proof course okay it should be not less than 2.5 five centimeter okay this is the fourth term guys the fifth one is minimum thickness of rcc slab that is 0 0.125 meter okay r minimum should not be less than five inches this is for rcc slab minimum thickness okay guys the sixth one is grade of concrete denote it cement sand and aggregate okay so if anyone asks from you that what is grade of concrete in many videos i've already discussed what is grade of concrete and different uh, types of uh, grade of concrete okay so uh, you can also watch that video so the link is in the description of that video or uh, i will also tell you m stand for mix and 20 number can show you the characteristic uh, strength of uh, the characteristic compressive strength of concrete after 28 days okay so the m20 ratio is 1 ratio 1.5 ratio 3 where 1 is cement and uh, 1.5 is uh, fine aggregate and 3 is crush r aggregate okay coarse aggregate ca right this is the sixth term of uh, 200 technical terms so guys uh, here we have in this video just 10 terms okay so in next video i will also discuss uh, next 10 terms like this so now we have the seventh one that is lapping of bar okay overlapping of bar or lapping of bar not allowed if the diameter of the bar is more than 36 millimeter as you can see guys this is one steel bar and this is the uh, second steel bar okay when we are lapping it with each other so if the dia of the bar is more than 36 millimeter okay so there we will not overlap uh, okay so the steel should not be overlap if the dia is more than 36 millimeter okay now guys the eighth one is dl uh, means or dl stand for specially in steel structure okay and also in a civil engineering drawing so it stands for or it's uh, it means development length so what is development length guys you can see here <clears throat> this is rcc beam okay so when uh, the longitudinal bars of plant beam or top beam okay so at the end of the support here these bars we keep same like this okay so this is called development length dl okay so dl means development length right guys the ninth one is c slash c c slash c means in civil engineering drawing or 
uh, in steel structure it means center to center distance between two steel bar if that is uh, uh, in main bar or in distribution bar especially in rcc slip or this is a uh, spacing for stirrups or this is the spacing of uh, you can say a uh, lateral ties but c slash c means center to center distance between two bars are between two columns okay guys the last one is in this video uh, the 10 terms uh, that is use minimum four numbers of steel bars in square or in rectangular column use minimum four numbers of steel bars if that is square column or rectangular column this this one is rectangular column but we should not use less than four numbers especially in rectangular and also in square column now come to the circular column so in circular column use minimum six numbers of bar right one two three four five six one two three four five six okay minimum six numbers of steel bar should be used in circular column so guys, these are uh, 10 technical terms. In second video, I will discuss also uh, more uh, 10 technical terms. So like this, uh, I will complete 20 videos of this series. 200 technical terms for civil engineers. So guys, if this video is helpful for you, so must like this video and subscribe the channel with press bell icon. And yes, if you have any question related with this topic, so you can comment. I will try to reply your answer. Thanks for watching. See you in next video. Goodbye.